Trevor Schrader is the son of Mike Schrader and Mona Knox. He happens to be my cousin, too. Trevor Schrader was born on September 28, 1989. He served in Operation Iraqi Freedom. His branch is the Army. His rank is a specialist. The way he kept in touch with his family is by Facebook on the computer and 15 minutes of calling each day. He wasn't drafted, he enlisted. At that time, he lived in Big Cabin, Oklahoma. He joined because most of his family has been in the Army. At boot camp, they trained him a lot and yelled at him. He only remembers uh, a few of his instructors. He got through by writing letters and getting email. Trevor said the food wasn't very good and some of the soldiers were cooks, but he still didn't like it. Sometimes his group stopped at a little store. They had bananas and other fruits. They mostly got the bananas because they tasted the be best. Trevor had felt pressure and stress, and he thinks everyone does. He and his buddies make up a handshake for good luck. To entertain themselves, they sang, danced, made stupid videos, and played on their laptops. Some Texas cheerleaders came and visited to get autographs. His group stayed in Iraq. Soon, Trevor and his group will be going to Hawaii. The only thing they did that was humorous was the stupid videos. They played a couple of pranks. One of the pranks involved sneaking up and scaring each other. Another one was to go up to a new guy and say, we need a brass magnet, will you go find it? Then to then the new guy went to the truck to look for it and came back and said he couldn't find it. He started to yell at him for it. The truth is there is no such a thing as a brass magnet. Trevor only got along with his squad. The rest was hard for him to get along with. Trevor, when he arrived, he said he was nervous and hot. He said it was like a hot blow dryer right in your face. He picked up ballot boxes and took them 